Getting to know you, getting to know all about you. Uh, hello and welcome to a very special edition of Getting to Know You. Now, you will know this person. This is Debbie Appleyard. You'll have recognised her from many, many plays. Joan Bowie. Murders in the Air. Murders in the Air. <laughs> your, your play. <laughs> oh, okay. Treasure Island. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lynn Street Nativity. Yeah. <laughs> so, as you can see, she's been a member for um, a long time. How many? Uh, about Three. two, just over two and a half years. Two and a half yeah, years. Yeah, yeah. Um, and she is having a very special birthday this year. Um, <laughs> So we've decided, to, rather than timing our getting to know you, we will do 50 questions for 50 years. Yay! <laughs> Deb is on Instagram and you can follow her at uh, Debbie5450, that's right, yep, isn't it? Yep, that's yep. right, yep. So if you find her and you can see all the things that she's been yep. doing so far, what have you done? 10? 10, I've done, yeah. 10 so, so far. I'm looking for more ideas as well. So yes, if you've got ideas for Deb to do yep. 50 for 50, then please comment down below and I'll pass them on to her. Um, so here we go, 50 questions. Okay. okay let's go. So it's not being timed, just 50 questions. 50 questions. You still need to do as uh, quick as possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Would you rather have a photographic memory or gain 40 IQ points? Uh, photographic memory. Would you rather never have internet access again or never be able to take a plane again? Uh, never be able to have internet access, I think. I'd like to travel. <laughs> I don't not have enough phone for 50 know. hours. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't want to travel though. <laughs> Uh, what's your favourite holiday destination? Uh, I'd like to go to Mauritius. I've never been. That's where I'd like to go. Uh, what's the best concert you've ever been to? Oh, just going to really sound like Phil Collins. I went that long ago. I love Phil Collins. I mean, I've never seen him live. <laughs> uh, what's your co favourite comedy movie? My comedy movie? Oh, dear. Oh, comedy, comedy. Yeah, I like. I've just seen one recently. Water for Elephants, really, really good movie, oh, I've seen that but not comedy. No, but I really not. do like it. Yeah. Okay, so that's we'll, my answer. We'll take that. <laughs> I, la I maybe laugh a little bit. <laughs> uh, would you rather explore a new planet or the deepest parts of the ocean? A uh, new planet. Uh, if you could live on Mars, would you? No. <laughs> <laughs> if you could not. play an instrument that you can't play now, what would it be? Um, the piano. Uh, what's your favourite season? Summer. <laughs> It's gotta be, yeah, it's gotta be. Uh, who was your favourite cartoon character as a child? Um, I did like Tom and Jerry. Tom and Jerry, so. <laughs> uh, what is the fanciest restaurant you've ever eaten at? Um, oh, we went to a, a, um, a Jamie Oliver restaurant, I think, with Ooh. work, I think, sometime. Yeah, that was really nice. Fancy. Yeah, 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 it was nice. Uh, what was your favourite subject at school? Um... I don't have to say, uh, I don't know, something arty, do you yeah. know what I mean? Not, 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 yeah, something arty. Something arty. Yeah, arty. Uh, if you could live in a book, a TV show or a movie, where would it be? Um, Neverland. Oh. <laughs> if you could bring one famous person back from the dead, who would it be? Oh. Um, Elvis Presley. Yeah. I <laughs> love a bit of Elvis. Uh, which one of your five senses would you give up if you had to? Like, oh, um, oh, smell. I think everyone says smell. smell yeah, you, are, you go through them, don't you? Yeah, yeah, them. definitely smell. I think I could do with that. Um, what animal best represents you? Um, a cat, probably. Very independent. <laughs> uh, if you had one superpower, what would it be? Um, invisibility. Yeah. If yeah. you could time travel, would you go back or forwards? Uh, I'd go back. If you could have dinner with one person, living or dead, who would it be? Um, ooh, well, not very famous. Well, I don't know. I'd, I wouldn't mind dinner with Freddie Fred. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like. <laughs> um, what is home to you? Home? Um, well, here, Cleetha. I've, I've never moved anywhere else, so Cleetha up is my home. I wouldn't be from it. If you can change one law, what would it be? One law? Um, oh, that's a tricky 
this morning. Uh, I've, well, I've changed the age of drinking. Higher or lower? A bit higher. I counted the question. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, a bit higher, I think. Yeah. A bit higher, yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't mind because I'm, I'm assuming that I'm <laughs> aware of that now, so that yeah. doesn't yeah. affect me. No. But, um, if you could speak another language fluently, what would it be? Uh, Spanish. I can't speak English fluently. No, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> if you could change one event from history, what would it be? Change one event. Um, well, 9-11. Yeah. Uh, tea or coffee? Tea. If you could ask Donald Trump one question, what would it be? <laughs> Not swear at him. <laughs> Who is he? <laughs> what is he about? <laughs> what are you? Who are you? <laughs> if you were on death row, this is a really nice question. Oh my gosh. What would your final me meal be? Oh, fish and chips. <laughs> Oh, that's and and lemon, meringue, love, lemon meringue pie. I love how that's the quickest answer. Oh, yeah, because I like to do like fish and chips. <laughs> um, favourite colour? Oh, pink. Uh, favourite book? Um, well, um, oh, favourite book. Oh, what was it? Girl on the Train. Really enjoyed that oh, one. Yeah, Girl on the Train. Yeah, really good. Um, tragedy or comedy? Oh, comedy. Plays or musicals? Musicals. If someone played you in a film of your life, who would be playing you? Oh, um, oh. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Um, maybe Goldie Hawn, maybe? Yeah, yeah I like Goldie, Goldie Hawn. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, if you were a vegetable, what would you be? A <laughs> vegetable? <laughs> I would be uh, um, broccoli. <laughs> Oh, there's all so many different things in there from broccoli. It's yeah. not just straight and, you know, it's a bit more complex, isn't it? Oh, when I read yeah. that question, I immediately thought cucumber for me. And I was like, why cucumber? Yeah, but broccoli's got loads of branches, hasn't yeah. it? So you yeah. like, you know, different bits. Um, this is a good one. Red rosé or white wine? Oh, rosé. Prosecco or champagne? Oh, Prosecco, Ooh. yeah. Uh, what was the last film that you watched? Um, last film that I watched? Oh, we just watched um, uh, Instant Family. Is that what you did at the cinema? Oh no, what did you watch at the cinema? Oh, The Boy You Want Would Be King. Really oh. good film, yeah. Uh, if you could travel anywhere in the world, where would it be? Anywhere in the world? Oh, um, I'd like to go to New York. Favourite city? Might be New York. <laughs> yeah, New York. Don't know what it's like, but it looks good. <laughs> uh, who is your hero? Who is my hero? Um, well would have to be my family member, my mum really, yeah, yeah. Uh, what was your dream job growing up? My dream... <laughs> to work in a sweet shop, <laughs> yeah. I always wanted to work in a sweet shop, yeah. I did. <laughs> Aim high, yeah. What is your job now? I work in a pharmacy. It like a sweet shop for some people. This is true, <laughs> this is true. Favourite play? Um, oh, this is tricky. Um, not musical, play. No, because no, the next one's okay. musical. So. Play. Well, I did. Say, I saw The Girl on the Train as a play, oh, and that was fantastic. Oh, I didn't realise it. Oh, my God, it was amazing. We oh, saw it at okay. Leeds. Yeah, yeah. So, favorite yes. Favourite play? Is next favourite musical? Uh, Blood Brothers. Um, if you could trade places with someone for a day, who would it be? Um... The queen. The queen. The Let's see how she lives. <laughs> uh, if you could, uh, what do you do as a hobby apart from this, obviously? Um, exercise. <laughs> Sorry, boring. <laughs> uh, what's your favourite smell? Oh, uh, flowers. Smells of flowers. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, what's the sound that you love the most? The sound. Oh, raindrops on conservatory oh, or caravans. Yeah. Rain. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, if you found a case of money on the street, would you keep it? Yeah! Uh, what is your ty favourite time of day? Um, morning. Morning. I'm a morning person, yeah. Really <laughs> Main course or dessert? Ooh! I would have said dessert, but I think I'm... Yeah, main course. Really? Yeah. Well, yeah! <laughs> I still need a dessert option. <laughs> uh, if you dropped a sandwich on the floor, would you still eat it? Um, uh, not a problem, okay, but 
on there. Well, I don't think I'm more than a bit. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Is well, it? Done. That's 50 questions. No way. No, nope, that is it. 50 questions. Oh, my We've done them. It wasn't that hard, was it? Oh, no. <laughs> a few little bits. <laughs> Okay, so as you can probably hear, we are on the first night of tech rehearsal for A Foot in the Door, which Deb is in, and you play... Jilly Jordan. Jilly Jordan. And a key, is... I'm, I'm a keyboard salesperson, so... There you are. Yes. So, uh, keyboards. Keyboards. <laughs> keyboards, yeah. Keyboards to poor, lonely me. Yeah. So, uh, A Foot in the Door starts on Saturday the 2nd of yep. March and continues until Saturday the 9th of March, yeah. excluding the Sunday. Yeah. You can get tickets from www.capstantheatre.com and also from the Heritage Centre and Pinkhorps Library yeah. tourist information. I'm getting like <laughs> so many things going on at this minute that my head's just going, wow! Okay, thank you ever so much for watching. Thank like you. I said at the beginning, if you've got any um, things that Deb can do for yep. 50 for 50, then please drop us a comment below. And if there's anybody else that you want to see on a normal getting to know you, then please drop their name below as well. And remember to like and subscribe. Yay. Thank you very much, Deb. Thank you. <laughs> getting to know you, getting to know all about you.